I'm here now with Moata Sam Auda, and he is the chief executive of Towson Precision Industries. Um, I'm just looking at some of this magnificent work here, and this, of course, all manufactured material for the oil and gas industry. It's taken this country quite a while to actually be producing something like this. Exactly. Uh, this region is very famous of oil production, and uh, now we want to take to go into the step of manufacturing the needs and manufacturing the components that's required to produce and uh, explore this oil in this region. It will, uh, our advantage here that uh, we have the capability, we have the know-how, how to manufacture, how to produce any certain component for this market. We're close to the customer, we can get a quick feedback. And uh, also we are keen into starting uh, the, our R&D jobs. With the and developing the uh, the components with the with the with our customer, um, as you say, it took a while for the manufacturing. All the oil and gas here for so many years, and you were importing everything. So you're really one of the leaders in this field in terms of the manufacturing of precision instruments. Now, I mean, these these are very precision instruments, and the finish on these are just incredible. Give us a feel for what this is, and what they give us a bit of detail. And I love this one because uh, you're making one over there. So tell us about this one. Well, this is just, uh, we are demonstrating the uh, high complexity milling that we can do uh, in the machinery that we have. Uh, it's just demonstrating how sophisticated, sophisticated could be the piece. And this is uh, really a high sophisticated five axis simultaneous milling uh, component. Uh, the other components here showing that we can provide several kind of uh, coatings yes. on the, uh, on the uh, oil and gas components. Finish on this is just absolutely incredible. This is a BVD coating, a nano composite coating that we are trying on ball valves. It has a very high surface hardness and very low friction coefficient. And also it has a acceptable and actually very good wear resistance and corrosion resistance also. So we, we, we're trying to implement new technologies and providing it locally uh, close to our uh, customers. Uh, not only that, it's also uh, going with the uh, hardening processes. We have on-house uh, heat treatment shop where we apply uh, plasma nitriding, vacuum carburizing, uh, and other type of hardening. Being that, uh, along with the machining capability, under one roof, give us a very good competitive advantage. We make the supply chain shorter, more, more efficient, and very uh, active response to the market need and to the customer needs. Well, it's, I mean, it's absolutely super, and it's great to see this material and these, you know, very, very vital components been actually made here. Now, you know, this is, as you say, state-of-the-art material, high-precision industry. Do you have enough people here, qualified people, that can actually, you know, fill fill your workforce? Actually, manpower is uh, is the issue of every industry. Uh, it's not the the current time, also the future. We have realized that man, uh, having the right manpower, having the right caliber, the right uh, education for the people is very important. At, at our current stage, we do have enough capable people to take this job on and deliver it at the right conditions. But we're not forgetting the future. Along with our parent company, Tawazan Holding, we, are, we uh, started up two years ago a work study program where we take every year 20 students, we send them to uh, conventional training into uh, uh, it's a kind of apprenticeship program where they go for a year get trained on machining on the manufacturing technology and after that they go to the UAE University for three days every week and come to work in the company every uh, two days every week so when they graduate they're not just fresh graduates they have competences they have experience they have a know-how where we can get them right away in the job and that's actually fascinating, and for that I know, congratulations to you, you've been nominated for an award up there with some of the big players. So you must be very proud to be nominated for an award in terms of the excellence in energy. Actually we are very proud of that because we're contributing to, the, to our society, we're uh, contributing to the, uh, to the development of uh, local talents. And uh, we are very proud about that. We're really proud about it. Good, and I wish you the best of luck on it. Now, tell me, how's the stand been? How's the conference been? Lots and lots of people just running around here. And I see, you know, your people, engineers, explaining what's going on to people in great detail. How's the response been here? Well, actually, uh, we can we can really tell there is a big excitement excitement from people visiting the the exhibition in general to see that there is local manufacturing 
people are providing, we're, we're not competing with anybody. We're just helping the OEMs, we're helping the uh, solution providers in manufacturing. So we are support. A lot of excitement, uh, as I told you, because they can see things happening, which is very important. And we're also explaining uh, to our customers now that we are into three different markets. We are into the defense business, we are into the aerospace business, and we are into the oil and gas business. Oil and gas business is uh, fairly new to us. Uh, to us, We started at the beginning of this year, but we're expanding in that business uh, heavily. And it's going to be our, uh, one of our major businesses. And indeed, we wish you the very best to Wazen Precision Industries, uh, manufactured here on the local base. Um, well done, and I wish you the very best. Thank you very much, and we're very proud about it. Thank you.